hello everyone welcome back in the last video we covered how clients uh, can give us access through spp today we are taking it one step further uh, i'll show you how to add sub users under your spp account so your team can work securely and efficiently by the end of this video you will know exactly how to set up sub users and manage their permissions like a pro so step one is uh, go to the user permission section, uh, go to the user management, click users and select add users. Now enter the name and email of the person you want to add. Click the send invite. You will see a page uh, with the invite link. Copy that link and send it to your teammate. When the teammate uh, accept the invite, uh, their status will first show as need verification. Once they complete verification, it will update to active status and the edit button will become clickable. Click edit and you will be taken to the added user permission page. Select the countries or regions you want to provide access for and scroll down uh, or search for the specific permissions you want to assign. Once done, click save changes. So step two is sub user site flow. Uh, when your teammate opens and white link, the first step is to sign up. After the signing up, they will see a page asking them to accept invitation. So remember, this is the SPP site, not the seller central. Once accepted, Amazon will ask for verification. So to verify, uh, the sub user must provide a valid password a bank statement and that at least 30 days old and the US phone number. Once approved, they will be fully active and you can manage their permissions. So this was the complete process. Now you know how clients can add you as an authorized partner and how you can add your teammate member as sub users inside SPP. This system is secure, professional and much better than old uh, secondary user method so in my next video i will share pro tips for agencies and freelancers to manage multiple accounts smoothly inside spp i'm Omar, helping you simplify e-commerce and amazon management see you in the next video